Ah, Capricorn. Okay, I've tried to do your reading three times. Every single time something goes wrong. The eight of <laughs> the eight of wands in reverse. Yes, every single time my communication gets blocked. Let's see if we can sort this out and get you your love reading for the weekend of the 27th to the 29th. If this resonates with you, please make sure that you... What one's that? Oh, Knight of Swords coming through as well. Please make sure that you like and subscribe. And don't forget to leave me a comment in the section comment section below letting me know what's going on in your life. Um, also, if you want to take advantage of possibly getting the bonus read for next week, make sure you like this video. The sign with the most likes on their weekend video always gets a bonus read uh, released on the Monday and that extends to the end of October at the moment okay but let's get your love messages let's see if we can get this through okay seven of wands was poking out then at me so again blockages blockages all over the place is that why I can't read for you at the moment because you're all blocked open up release your energy I can't get through to you all right here we go Ah, yes, please open up, connect with your higher self so that I can reach you. I can't get to you guys for some reason. There's, I don't know what's going on with you. All right, that's the high priestess. What else have we got, please, for love messages for my Capricorn? Thank you. Jumpers. Four of swords in the upright. Well, that's good. Feeling peaceful, at peace got your high high priestess so you might be trying to maybe you're just so deep in meditation i actually can't reach you guys maybe that's what it is like you're just out of my vibration or is it because you're stuck in eight of swords okay so there is some trapped uh thoughts going on and again this is a, a blockage of the mind the eight of swords <clears throat> okay eight of cups just flipped over in the deck <sighs> okay and is this because you're trying to you're not willing to face that maybe you need to walk away from something it's got you trapped yep and the queen of pentacles in reverse so she is not moving forward with offers or love or or anything okay she's actually a little bit in in unstable instable <laughs> unstable we'll go with um okay capricorn let's get some more information what's the high priestess please why is she blocking my channel she should be on my side high priestess She's not even in reverse she's in the upright okay so you are okay i'm gonna keep going first <clears throat> you are afraid to move on because you are what's well, taking it's not that you're afraid to move on there is an element of that here but it's taking you a really long time to heal from whatever is upsetting you. And part of the reason it's taking a really long time is because you're focused on the fact that you're on your own and you, you're not okay with that. So although your high priestess is in the upright, which is great, and you are doing everything you can to connect with your higher self, um, you're working on that healing. That's That's what's happening here. All right. So you are probably doing a lot of meditation, a lot of self-reflection, trying to find that peace. Can I have uh, something for the four of swords, please? Letting go of regret. Excellent. Okay. So you, this is, you're actually getting there, but then something stops you. Why are we back in eight of swords, please? How do we get back in eight of swords? I feel like this is actually your past energy and this is kind of where you're at now and that's why I can't get through. 
because someone has come back but they are not offering you what you wanted them to offer you so they're refusing to make you an offer or they're not interested in making an offer not they're refusing to they're not interested in making you an offer and you can't stop thinking about that it's possible that they chose someone else um, it looks like perhaps they were juggling between the two of you or un not not able to decide whether they still wanted to be with you or not and they have decided that they don't want to be with you or they have selected a third party there's no third party cards on the table but sometimes that's what that means uh, and you're struggling now to walk away because i think you got your hopes up capricorn eight please the eight of cups yes hmm. so they have somehow come popped back up in your life i don't think that they've actually come towards you with an offer i think that you've maybe seen something or you've discovered that they have decided to move on and it's put you back a few steps capricorn okay ah yes the moon card just fell out in reverse so you have discovered some sort of hidden information and i don't know how you've come across this there's no spy cards on here but you've you've come across it and it's like i said it's set you back in your healing so you're kind of doing all right um you didn't really want to be single but you were kind of releasing some of the negative thoughts focusing on yourself connecting with your higher self doing meditation all that great great stuff somehow you've come across this information and it basically has confirmed to you that this person has decided to take another path for the moment um and it is kind of rocking your world a little bit okay uh, let's get something for the queen of pentacles in reverse please you've shut down this is you shutting down over here Yeah, because you're back there. Yeah, two things with this card, Seven of Cups. So uh, one, it's thrown you into a state of confusion again. Um, I don't know whether you were under some impression that they were maybe still interested down the track. I don't know, but it's kind of confused you. But also they might have had lots of other options that they've now made a selection from. Um I have another one for that, please. And it's caused you to right, clam up, shut down, uh, go into hiding, not want to see or talk to anyone. Yeah, confusion. So, you know, I'm clarifying with clarifiers, basically. Um, they're clarifying the same thing. So there's de these decisions and um, or indecisiveness. I think with this card, though, this could be that you're kind of thinking about okay well what does this mean for my future which is good um go see how she's turned away from one of the ones so it could be that this is going to help you come to terms with the fact that this wand is not going to be around anymore um and you're facing that so you're facing the other wand all right let's do thoughts and feelings please justice just came out so uh this is Kind of for the best, by the sounds of things. What's the thoughts and feelings for Capricorn, please? Thoughts and feelings for Capricorn. Oh, two cards trying to come out. Okay. All right. So it could be someone that you work with or is somehow connected to your work. It's making you really bitter and you're not really... It's actually making you really angry at work. So just be cautious of that. Um, your... This closed up agitated state that you've got over here because of what you've discovered that's coming through in your workplace so it's possible that someone is or has spoken to you about that or is going to speak to you about that you might be struggling to go to work you might be struggling to concentrate when you're at work yeah because you're focused on the fact that this person um 
has chosen someone else or has decided on a different path you're for, you want them to come back to you you're you're like why won't they offer me that opportunity okay um let's do their thoughts and feelings and see if we can get some insight their thoughts and feelings please other person's thoughts and feelings They're not moved. They're chariot in reverse. They're not moving forward with this anymore at the moment. Okay. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Not making an offer. Not, not moving forward with this at the moment. Okay. I'm so sorry, Capricorn. Might not be what you want to hear. But I actually think this is what you already know. I think that you were okay with this over here. But then because you've seen this thing, it's just taken you back a few steps and now you're having to really face, okay, this really is it. Um, I want you to focus on how good you were back here because you will get there and you'll get there quicker. It won't take you as long this time because you've already been there. You've gone, you've kind of processed the heartbreak. This is just a bit of a, a little bit of a kick, that's all. Most likely outcome for Capricorn this weekend, please. Yeah, you're in your Queen of Swords reversed energy, that's for sure. You've got Queen of Swords reversed and the Queen of Wands reversed. They're the, like, scariest queens to have reversed. You are, like, angry and cold at the same time. Wow. Okay, no one should cross you this weekend. But you are going to accept that it is a closed cycle for the moment. Who knows what will happen down the track? But for the moment, this cycle has finished. It is closed. <clears throat> you are probably going to be spying still. I don't know that there's any value in that. I don't have any judgment about people that spy. I've been known to take a sneaky peek myself from time to time. But you, it's, it's coming out in your most likely outcome. So it's possible that maybe it'll make you feel better. You know what? You do you. Whatever you need to get through this. But you're ending the weekend with the fool. So I think something in this spying is actually going to trigger you to want to make the new start and step out and go, you know what? I actually remember why I was okay with this before I found this out. You are going to be fine by the end of the weekend. I know you don't feel like that now, but like you've got the world card and then the full so a whole new fresh start for you that's really exciting this is also a travel card so maybe it's time to think about getting away booking some travel okay you may already be thinking about that let's get you some advice i feel like this was a very heavy reading but i'm really loving the outcome for this weekend <clears throat> okay What advice is there for Capricorn for this weekend, please? Oh, two cards. Okay, so Hierophant and uh, Five of Pentacles. Yeah, so, um, sorry, Five of Pentacles in reverse. So yes, you are going to discover something about a previous relationship. Uh, let's see what they've got to say about it though. Seven of Cups, that's what's driving the confusion. Six of Wands, clarify by the Six of Wands. That confusion is not going to make you feel good. What's the advice though, Spirit? I think that they're kind of just making you aware <clears throat> that this is what's happening. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Take one more, please. I'm running out of ah thank you this is where we were going with this i was like where are you taking me with this advice this is an advice this is stuff we just covered right so yes this is going to something's being brought up about a previous relationship you are finding something out about a previous relationship that is going to elicit feelings of confusion and you are not going to feel good about it you are going to want to hide yourself away and it's kind of going to be a bit crappy i'm sorry capricorn you are not going to want to work 
you're not going to want to go to work, you're not going to want to work with anyone else, you're not going to want to see anyone, you just kind of want to do your own thing and that's fine. But please don't forget that you do have the four of wands coming towards you. So although you have not been successful in this relationship, universe has recognized all the work you've been doing over here and how good you got yourself and that's not going to go unrewarded so they have four of wands in process for you that is the twin flame uh soulmate perfect marriage amazing family card like it's like it's, it's as good as the star card but love basically okay so oh, i'm so glad that that's where that went to i was getting a little bit nervous of where are they leading me here but that's good that's clear excellent let's get a romance angel for you guys all right romance angels please so romance angels advice for capricorn please engagement your love is ascending to a higher level of commitment i feel like that is what is coming for you okay so you're going through all of this for a reason it does not feel like that i know but a hundred percent it is leading you to this engagement and a four of wands that's like the person you are destined to be with so it's on its way i think that once you get get back to this state start releasing again don't let this disrupt you book some travel get the hell out of here uh, book some travel start on your new start this weekend do whatever spying you need to do, get it out of your system, and then start fresh. Block that person. All right. So thanks so much, uh, Capricorn. I will see you for the weeklies. If you found this resonated or you want to tell me about what's going on in your life in relation to this particular reading, please leave me a comment down in the comment section. Um, and don't forget to like the video for the bonus read. Have a great weekend and I will see you for the weeklies. Bye.